New tonight, fire forces dozens of people from their homes in West Knoxville. Knoxville fire crews did respond to an emergency call just before six at Hamilton House condos on Kennesaw Avenue. Witnesses reported seeing smoke from a second floor apartment and within minutes fire crews arrived on that scene and put out the flames. Reporter Mary Klingler takes us to the scene tonight for a look at the firefight and what's next. When firefighters arrived on the scene, Knoxville Assistant Fire Chief Mark Wilbanks says fire crews quickly got the fire under control and there are no injuries. So we had an apartment on fire. Um, that particular apartment has sustained heavy damage. Now, hours later, dozens who live here don't know when they'll get to go home. We had the electricity off and that does play a huge role in whether or not they have to go somewhere else. We're not going to leave them here without power. Wilbank says the fire started in a second floor apartment. The man who lives there was at work. They knocked on the door. He didn't answer. The cause of the fire is under investigation. We didn't think it was a big fire. We thought it was just like a little fire and then everyone's like, get, get the heck out, get the heck out. People are yelling. A frightening moment for the ones who live here, but they say they're happy everyone is okay. At first I was like, well, maybe it's a drill. Once Neil and Prince made it outside, he quickly realized it wasn't a drill. He took this picture. I just immediately thought, oh no, you know, um, it was very sad. I was shocked at first, you know, it just, I couldn't really believe that it was happening right there and you know where I live at. Prince says he will likely travel home to stay with family in Morristown. For those who don't have a place to go, the American Red Cross is assisting. I'm thankful no one got hurt. Could have been my condo, so I'm glad it wasn't. Reporting in Knoxville, I'm Mary Klingler. At last check tonight, investigators still haven't released a cause of that fire.